as you mentioned, Hurricane Isaac, the remnants of that storm still pouring down across the Northeast, which meant for many families, the children went back to school in slickers and boots. But down in the Gulf, school was canceled for a lot of children as the region dicks out from those floods. And here's ABC's Ryan Owens. 16-year-old Sean McCurley should be in school today. Instead, he's helping his parents clear debris from their Laplace, Louisiana home. They could use the help. We don't even know where to begin, to be honest with you. It's hot and sticky, and my house is stinky, and the carpets are all wet and molds growing. Nearly their entire neighborhood had to be rescued by boat last week. One thing that couldn't be saved, the nearby elementary school. Classrooms were flooded with a foot and a half of water. Today, cleanup crews roam the halls instead of its 650 students. While this may be the first day of school for most in Louisiana, about 130 public schools are closed in the hardest hit parishes. What do you think is going to happen? Yeah. And soon, we'll, I think we'll be able to go back to school. Once everything gets back to normal, I, I think we'll be, be able to go back to school. Here in St. John Parish, they are now planning to open the schools next week some of the schools. East St. John High School is still surrounded by water. It will be months before kids can return here. Right now, the parish is scrambling to figure out when and where those students will go back to class. Diane.